camp and the Tiger Girls are still going strong. Today, teens will be working on their fight song. The fight song is one of the most beloved traditions at LSU. And here at UDA camp, they'll have the opportunity to be evaluated on their traditional fight song. Earlier, they met with Joe for private coaching. Let's see how it went. Ladies, good. Okay, so bring it in for a second. There's a couple of just different sections that I want to go over with you guys. So we did private coaching today uh, for Fight Song. It went really well. Uh, they made sure that everyone was extra sharp and really spirited throughout the whole thing. Our Fight Song is very traditional and one of the biggest things at LSU. So it's really important that it looks well and it's very long. So our girls need to definitely stay energetic throughout the whole thing. Up five, six, seven, eight. Go one, two, three, four, five, six. Hit it out. Look. Yeah? So make sure that pop is big. We want to see that. Watch this palm motion right here. You don't want it to go into a candlestick. It's our first time actually doing Fight Song as a team, so we want to know from the beginning how it looks and that we can you know, keep up and everything. So their critiques are really um, helpful to what we do, and we'll definitely keep that in mind throughout the whole year. Keep up the energy! Let's go! So let's make sure we're in straight lines. So kind of fix yourselves, look around, make sure your toes are all in a line. For the most part, the girls are great at projecting. They're great at showing that school okay, spirit, but they have issues um, with their palm technique and their spacing. And she did a great job of getting in there. And that's something that they can take back home and really work on. The beginning up until Jazz Hay is awesome. Like the beginning, whenever y'all are popping on your seven, you know how everything hits on a seven? Y'all are like really popping your palms and they're sticking. It gets really noticeably tired at the end, you know, when you're going down, up, down, up. And then the presto, the switching groups, especially since your formation is squeezed together, you can tell, like y'all aren't locking your arms out and it's not like hitting and your palms aren't all clicking at the same time. If you know that you need to spread out on all of that, it looks so much better. It's almost like you forget about it until that moment happens and then you think, oh, I need to scoot, like scoot over more. So y'all have to think about that. What comes right before this? You all need to think about that right away, like you, how much you've got to spread out into that last thing. Well, we represent our school, and we are the ones that bring the spirit at the games and get the crowd involved, so it's our job to have the fight song clean and have so much energy throughout the whole thing because it's our job to get the crowd active in the game and to get them excited. much better after the kick line on that spread out part and it actually looked good transitional wise because the formation crossed it was so much better I think y'all looked awesome that was really fun I think y'all had a good time doing it so very good